What's up guys, it's your boy Tempe here. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to fix your ECU. Um, I already done it on this board, I'm not going to redo it, but I'm going to explain on how to fix it. The tools you will need for sure is a soldering iron, a desoldering pump, this one is shit, don't buy those, you buy like a heat one, heat gun, heat gun, and then you want to desolder these two chips right here. Um, first chip on the board, you'll see it's this small IC right here. This is off this board. I put in the one for my car into here. So you won't have to go to the steel ship. Uh, it should be IC240. This is your EEPROM chip. And I believe this is uh, as well. You need to desolder this, which is going to look something like this. Which is your, like, I think, I believe this is for your key fob and the steering column to communicate with the EEPROM. Uh, so it's like the immobilizer shit. So once you get these two done, you should be able to just uh the ecu should be able to work i bought this ecu from the junkyard for 50 bucks it turns out to pay off uh and i just desoldered this chip and then this instantly worked i'm gonna put it put, i'm putting it back together as you speak i have like one more two more screws up here in the cover and i'm gonna put it back in the car and yeah also shout out to him for telling me which EEPROM chips to delete to swap over shout out it's your boy Tempe signing off peace